Hey everybody, Frank Sapsky here, the Polish Pizziola, member of the Pizza Gavones. We review the pizza, the place, and the personality. And remember, all our reviews are oven fresh pies, never anything in a box. I gotta be honest with you, I'm super excited to be in Milford, Connecticut today at a place called Papa's Pizza. This is my hometown, this is the first place I've been to when I moved here 26 years ago. We got Gorilla Gavone, and we got Donnie Spox. I know what this pizza is, but I want to have these guys check it out. This is Real Out Beats in Milford, Connecticut. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, we're down here at Papa's Pizza in Milford, Connecticut. This place has been around since 1986. Tonight we got two avis. We got a mozzarella and we got a shrimp and bacon. So we're gonna get ready, we're gonna eat some of these and we're gonna give you guys a review. Remember, we're the Pizza Gavones. Please hit the like button. Yes. Please subscribe. And most importantly, please leave a comment and let us know what you think about these videos and where else you want us to go. Enjoy. Bye. <laughs> Alright, Gorilla, so what do you got? Give us your number, give us a review. Quick down and dirty. I'm doing what a Gabon does of eating. <laughs> Bring it home. And you do it well, sir. Mm -hmm. Sauce is very good. Uh, some pretty decent crunch on there. Got definitely some good, uh, some nice, very nice CG on the back. What's the CG? That's that's the charred goodness. That's what it is. Um, my score is um, 84. Okay. 84 is my score on this one. This reminds me of old school pizza. Yeah. Friday night, back in the 80s, you know, Papa Gabon or Mama Gabon would bring home some pizza on a Friday night. This is exactly what it is. Hot, fresh, uh, Good crunch, extremely enjoyable. I can see why this is uh, the PTO's go-to place. Uh, when in Milford. When in Milford. I'm gonna go uh, right on, you know, right on, kind of on par with the uh, with the gorilla. I'm gonna go with 80 tree. 80 tree. 80 tree. Okay. All right, guys. So I'm gonna give my review on this Papa's Pizza. Just want to show you guys. Check this out. This is amazing. Char here. This cheese is cooked perfectly. Nice little bubbles in it, and um, take a look at this here. Underneath, this is just amazing leopardy. Like I said, I've been here many times. This is my go-to pretty much in Milford, and um, you know I think it's just fantastic pizza. My score on this here is going to be uh, 88. I'm giving this an 88. That's what I got. Hi. Yeah. I mean, we're all kind of around the same place. Yeah, wow. But the one thing I want to mention, we got a specialty pie. And we actually had a specialty pie elsewhere, which was incredible. This here is a uh, shrimp and bacon. It's called their number five. This is pretty, this is really good. Hey everyone, we're gonna talk about the place now. And to be honest with you, it's gonna be pretty straightforward. This Papa's Pizza on Nogatuck Ave in Milford, Connecticut is definitely a takeout place. Call up, they'll take your order, and you come pick it up. Right now, because of COVID, they've got a window that serves you like kind of like ice cream, but that's what this place is about. They do have Fox and Park, 
over here. You know we're big Fox and Park fans. Oh, yeah. um, they have all kinds of flavors of Fox and Park. We got Russ, the owner here. We're gonna ask him a couple questions. He's super busy tonight, so we really appreciate his time. Russ, again, thank you for having us here. We really appreciate it. I'm a hometown Milford guy. I just want you to know that I put this on one of the Milford local pages on Facebook, and you got probably the most likes and comments, oh, wow. positive stuff that I've had pretty much from any place we've ever posted. Oh, so that's, awesome. that's a testament to you and your pizza. Thank you. This was my grandfather's property. And then we called him Papa. Ah. So I had a cousin. A so that's where Papa's came from. Yeah, yeah. And so you uh, got another one over yeah, on uh, Bridgeport Ave. Yeah. Yep. Thank God my daughter helps me, and this John helps me with 99% of the work I do. Wow. Uh, so, and I'm getting old, so it's tough. And I was telling, I was, was here during the week talking to a gentleman. He said that you come here at like 3 o'clock in the morning to make the dough? Yeah, well, 4. <laughs> uh, here's a little tragedy. You know, it's okay. not that I want to, but like when, when this COVID hit, it, we were never this busy. And now it's like nonstop. Yeah. So one last question, because I know you're busy. Okay. If you didn't have this place, obviously you probably eat a lot of pizza here, yeah. but if you didn't have this place, Papa's, where would you go for our beats? I would go to Pepe's. That was where I, I always, that's my, like, that, at the, back when we were younger, their pizza was non, you could not stop eating it. Yeah. It was that good. Yeah. There's a, you guys have a huge following. I mean, obviously yeah. I know there's other pizza places in Milford, yeah. but you know, by far, probably this is, yeah. uh, you know, number one. Well, thank you. Everybody's a pizza aficionado now. Oh, yeah, of course. you're not kidding. I have to prove myself every single day. Yeah. You, yeah. Can't, you can't slack. No, yeah. You guys make grinders too, right? Yeah, I make grinders. I just have these giant grinders. Just yeah, what they call cones or yeah, something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I heard some <laughs> things about, about yeah. those grinders. You don't go anywhere after you eat that. No, I have to start a whole new thing. You know, yeah, like a like gobble an grinder show or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's been a long time. Gorilla's Gobble and Grinder. There you go. <laughs> Triple G, baby. The Triple G. So anyways, Russ. Thanks for having us. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Pizza was great.